Do you have what it takes to be a business owner? In this video, I wanna look at the seven essential traits you must have. Let's go. trait that is so important to being a business owner is you really need to have an entrepreneurial mindset. You need to be someone that just doesn't want to sit back and wait for people to give you the structure, the processes, a handbook, any of that kind of stuff. You need to be the kind of person that wants to start something for nothing. You need to be the type of person that wants to start with air and turn it into something that people could touch and feel and buy. Second thing you need to have if you wanna be a business owner is a lot of self-discipline. You know, when I first started my business, for the first few years, actually, I did not sleep much. I had to work during the day, I had to work during the night. If something went wrong, I could not sleep until I fixed it. There were so many problems to figure out. There were so many things to make sure that I did for clients. It didn't matter if I was tired. It didn't matter if I was depressed. It didn't matter how I felt. I just had to get things done. So owning a business means that you're gonna be the kind of person that has a lot of self-discipline to never give up to get stuff done no matter what it takes. The third trait that you need if you wanna be a business ownership is strong leadership skills. Now, what does that look like? I think it looks like different things for different people. When you read about leadership and look at different great leaders of history, one thing is clear, they're so different from each other. So you need to lead in a way that's consistent with the person that you are, but you need to make sure that you're not getting in the way of people growing and Ultimately, leadership needs to be about giving people the freedom to do what they do best. You need to lead in a way that creates an environment that's optimal for growing a business. Are you a quiet leader? Are you a strong leader? Are you demanding? Are you nice? It doesn't matter. It just matters that you are bringing out the best in people and that you're doing it in a way that's predictable once people get to know you. So they work in an environment where they know what things are like from day to day and they could do what they gotta do with your guidance to make things happen. The fourth trait that you need if you're gonna be a business owner is that you need to be a learner, a lifelong learner. If there's anything that is for sure, it's that nothing is for sure. Things are gonna keep changing, thing or things are gonna keep evolving, and that's definitely the case when it comes to business. If you're not an ongoing student, if you're relying on last year's knowledge, chances are you're gonna be left behind in business. You need to be a curious person. You need to be someone that knows how to teach yourself or to learn from others, making sure that they're the type of people that you can learn from. Business owners, need to be people that have a voracious appetite for knowledge and make sure that it's not something that just sticks in their head, but they learn to apply that in their business and in their employees' lives. The fifth trait that's essential to being a business owner is you need to know what people want, even if they don't know that it's what they want. Often people feel like you need to look at something that already exists, identify a market that's out there, and then fit into it, and yes, to an extent, that's very true, but if you ever want to have a business that's truly going to grow, you need to be willing to think outside of the box and to see what's coming in the future that people are gonna want in order to prepare for it now. So you need to be the kind of person that just doesn't look behind you, but you're always looking ahead and making sure that your business already is prepared for where people are going to be in the days and weeks and years to come. The sixth trait that you need if you're gonna be a business owner is persistence and resilience. Having a business is hard work. It's not what it looks like on TV or in the movies or when you see people that seem like they have a lot of money. Business means a lot of sleepless nights. It means a lot of anxiety and stress. It means a lot of doing things that nobody sees just to make sure that everything's still going to work, things aren't going to fall apart. It is a thankless job. 
If anybody's gonna pat you on the back, it's gonna be yourself because nobody else is gonna care how your business is doing. In reality, business is a marathon that you so often have to run like it's a sprint. And so at times you're gonna feel out of breath and you need the resilience to be able to make it through, especially the challenging times. So are you willing to put in the work to be a business owner? The seventh trait that you need if you're gonna be a business owner is adaptability. Now more than ever because of technology, things are changing at a very rapid pace. Whether you are somebody that's been doing the same thing for a long time or you're newer to this, you're gonna find that you're gonna have to adapt at a much quicker rate than you would have if you were doing the same thing at an earlier time in history, if what you're doing even existed that long ago. You need to be willing to look at your business and be willing to change it, to go counterintuitive to some of the things that you might've thought would have worked before by really looking at the reality of the market and the world around you and what people are going to want. Businesses need to be more flexible than ever in history because changes are just simply happening so quick. And as a business owner, you're gonna need to be at the forefront of that. Even if you feel like you don't want more change, you're gonna have to be flexible and willing to adapt in order to be able to make it for the long run. There's countless case studies of businesses that chose not to adapt. You know, think of Kodak, you know, the camera company and so many other companies out there that were dominant market leaders in the world that now are barely doing anything because they just relied on what worked for them before and they weren't looking ahead to the future and being willing to adapt to how the world had changed around them. Adaptability is absolutely essential. When it comes to being a business owner, a lot of people will also feel like, you know, it's just something you're kind of born to do or not. You're either made that way or not. But I have to say for me, I don't believe that at all. If you look at these seven traits that I think are essential to being a business owner, all of these are things that you could develop in your life that you can learn, that you could grow into. You don't have to be perfect at all of them to get started, but these need to be seven traits that you're willing to commit to. So let's take a quick look back at what these seven traits are. First, entrepreneurial mindset. Second, self-discipline. Third, strong leadership skills. Fourth, you need to be a lifelong student. Fifth, you need to be able to tell what people want, even if they themselves don't know it. Six, you need persistence and resilience. And seventh, you need to have adaptability. I believe that if you are passionate about starting a business, you can make these things happen. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Take care.